what I see, yeah. What's up, brothers? Uh, How y'all doing? All right. For the most high created man to be immortal, uh -huh. and made him to be an image. I ain't gonna even deal with them, man. Y'all already know they don't want the truth. Do my own thing out here. Let them do their thing. What's up, bro? What's going on, man? Hey, y'all believe in the Bible? Jesus is a black man. Y'all know that, right? What's up, man? Come holler at me. What's up, guys? How y'all doing, man? What y'all know about the Bible, man? A lot. Come here, man. Let me ask you a question about Jesus. How you doing? Good. Yeah, do you believe uh, a man can live like Jesus in the earth? Can we walk perfect like Jesus? Do you walk perfect like Jesus? No. Do you believe that's possible? Or what? Uh, maybe. Because you're, you're a Christian, right? I am. I've been a long time since I've been church. You still smoke? I smoke cigarettes, yes. How are you a Christian and, and you still smoke and it's a habit fall I've had short? Since I was young. Yeah. Do you, do you think a man can make it into heaven if he smokes? I believe, yeah. If you ask for forgiveness. But don't you have to be delivered? Don't we have to be delivered from sin, from yes. smoking yeah, and you gotta ask adultery? For, you gotta and, ask for yeah, all of and not only ask, we must be delivered. Yeah. Because otherwise Christ would die in vain, correct? Yeah, that's correct. I'm giving you something to think about. I appreciate because it. God wants us to be perfect as he is perfect. You yeah. believe that? I do that's believe Matthew that. 548. You know you're talking to a perfect man? Uh, you see my shirt? God bless you. See what it says? Yeah, I am. Right. Real quick, are you equal with God? Do what? Are you equal with God? I'm not equal with God. Dad. You know I'm, you. I'm not there did, yet. Before you leave, did you know you have to be equal with God to to enter into the kingdom of God? You must become equal with God. Uh, that's where we're different. Did you, you do, that's Philippians uh, chapter two, verse five. Yeah. It says, yeah. "Let this mind be in you, which was also in Christ Jesus, who thought it not robbery to be equal with God." That's I, Philippians 2 5, King go, James Version. I can't give you a dog unless you're sorry for slavery. Are you sorry for I slavery? You. Well, quick exit, y'all. I tried to keep him around. Hey, sister. Hey, sister, how you doing? Come here, man. How you doing? I got, I got a question for you. Let me get you a car. Try to get her to talk. Yeah. Hey, how you doing, man? You doing all right? You believe in the Bible? Yeah, ignore me. So a lot of these people know who I am, man. So they gonna, they not gonna give me conversation. That's awfully rude. I guess you're not a, a believer in Christ, huh? I bet your friends think you a Christian. But you don't have the spirit of a Christian, right? You can't even speak to a man. That's very rude. So you just know you the devil, huh? You just walk in the spirit of the devil. Spirit of rudeness. You know Jesus Christ is a black man, right? White people are the children of Esau, Edom. God hates the children of Esau, Edom. Y'all know that, right? 
He's coming back to put your people into captivity. He that leadeth into captivity must go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. This is the faith and the patience of the saints. You got to pay for what your ancestors did. You reaping the benefits of, of their crimes, their wickedness. You're guilty by association because you're the descendants. Ain't that what they court systems do to us? If you with somebody and they commit a robbery, they say you're guilty by association. Uh-huh. What they sow, they got to reap, man. They are guilty by association. Esau's descendants, man. He stole this land, and they reap the benefits of it. They get white privilege. So all of them guilty. That's an automatic thing, man. That's like the cosmic. Thing. They all guilty, bro. I know some of y'all want to save them. Y'all say uh, they not all bad, all that. But the Bible said we shall be sold to our enemies. Deuteronomy 28, 68. So if they are enemies, they guilty by association, man. The Bible don't change. You know, generations go, generations come. Y'all get ready for captivity. For what your ancestors did, y'all going into slavery. Jesus is a black man. That's why y'all crucified him. That's why y'all crucified his descendants. The prison systems, the unjust judicial systems. They politics. Where's our reparations, man? They all guilty, man. Where's your reparations? You know you're not supposed to be working on 9 to 5? If they gave you your just due, you'd be a multi-millionaire. Everybody listening to this video, you of the 12 tribes of Israel, they give you your reparations, you, you're a multi-millionaire. You shouldn't be working 9 to 5. Your ancestors paid that for you. 400 years of captivity, man. They paid. They paid our sin debt. That's why the Lord took the chains off. That's why we had Jubilee. They call it Juneteenth. And the Bible is Jubilee. Which proves the white man, the white man is not fair. The white man is guilty because y'all didn't give us reparations. Oh, I yeah. heard all that before. Man. Yeah. We deserve it, man. 400 years. I heard it. No other nation has done that. 400 years without wages? Hey dude, I'm 30 years old, bro. <laughs> That's what makes you guilty, though. All your people are guilty. I know. All your that. people are guilty for what your ancestors did, what your forefathers did. I heard that so many times, man. Yeah, you're going to keep hearing it. Out of 30. So Jesus Christ comes back and puts y'all in chains. Y'all got to pay for that. What you sow, you got to reap. I'm 30, bro. Yeah, you guilty of the bloodshed of my ancestors. The, I've heard it. the ancestors of Jesus Christ. Those niggas are Israelites, Hebrews, the Jews, the priests, the kings, the prophets, the sons and daughters of the Most High God. Y'all got to pay for that. You got to pay for what your ancestors did. White people, y'all guilty. What's my reparations, man? Your house belongs to me. Your money belongs to me. Your clothes you got on your back belongs to me. Y'all owe me. Where's my money? Where's my reparations? Where's my money? I want my reparations, man. I want my loot. You guilty, man. By association. How you doing, sister? How you doing, queen? Y'all guilty by association. What your ancestors did, y'all got to pay for that. Hell yeah, you got do. blood on your hands, man. Yes, sir. Jesus Christ coming to collect. The black Messiah. He's going to collect. That good old redneck is proud of it. Guilty by association. Y'all know that? For what your ancestors did, you got to pay for that. You got blood on your hands. You got blood on your hands. Jesus Christ coming back to collect. America's falling, man. What's up, black man? 
America's Fallen, Babylon. Y'all enjoying y'all last days? Recession is here. Huh? America's circling the drain, man. They say by September these stores gonna be closed, man. How y'all doing? That's what's up. That's what's up. We in a recession, y'all know. It's a recession. Y'all better be doomsday prepping. Y'all better be doomsday prepping. We in a recession, man. Y'all doomsday prepping. Y'all know we in a recession, right? We know. About two months of fools left before they uh, close these stores, man. They great close these stores, bro. American Legion, that's the demons, man. That's demons. That dude name in the Bible was called Legion. What do you say? Uh, America shall be a uh, Babylon. And uh, Revelations 18. The house of devils. Every unclean and foul bird. Unclean spirits, man. Evil spirits. What's up, black man? Praise Jesus, man. Black power, man. How you doing? You know you're a king, right? You know you're a king, right? You know you're a king, right? You gotta start living like Jesus is a black man. You know that, right? Christ is a black man. We know we're the chosen people. Guilty by association. So, Edomites. You know y'all Edomites, right? Jesus Christ coming back to put Edomites in captivity. Edomites got to go into captivity. Edomites got to go into captivity. Edomites got to go into captivity. The black man is the king of the earth. It's our time. We got next, right? <laughs> we got next. You know, Jesus is a black man coming back for vengeance. Coming back to destroy the earth, destroy the wicked. And they blood shall be sprinkled upon his garments. He's gonna tread the wine vat. He's gonna tread the Edomites underfoot. And the righteous shall wash their feet in the blood of the wicked. Psalms 58, verse 10, ain't it? The righteous shall wash their feet in the blood of the wicked. The righteous shall wash their feet in the blood of the wicked. The righteous shall wash their feet in the blood of the wicked. God has labeled you wicked. You know that. Edomites are going into captivity. Your guns ain't going to save you. Your military, your government ain't going to save you. Huh? There's no weapon against the Lord. None that shall prosper. Ain't that right? You can't prosper your wrath against the Lord. He's laughing at you. He laughs at the wicked. He sits on high and looks down low. He's laughing at the wicked. You love your guns, but your guns ain't going to save you. Your guns ain't going to save you. big black man named Jesus Christ is coming back for the earth to give his people reparations. How you doing black sister? Good. Black power. Good. Let me give you a call. You know we the chosen, right? Well, you know what? I what's need up? the chosen to come and support our black businesses in the Circle Center Mall. That's what's up. We're on the second floor. First black department store. Okay. You okay. just got over there? 
Nine months now. Nine months? Yep. Okay. I What's your store called? You got a car? She Experience. I don't have it on me. She Experience. It's called She Experience, and it's what a you, collaboration of a bunch of women business owners. That's what's up. We came together to create a department store. Okay, what y'all got in there for us? Like women's clothes, men's clothes, stuff mm -hmm. like that? We got a little bit of everything. Bit Candles, everything. massages, cosmetics. Uh, clothing, shoes. The people hear you too. Oh, okay. Shouting it out. Well, cool. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so just cooperative economics. You know, mm -hmm. we just pushing our way through the system, you yeah. know, yeah. and showing everyone downtown what we have to offer. So we need your support. Let me ask you a question, and I mm -hmm. pretty much probably uh, can guess your answer. So you think we should have another Black Wall Street? That's what I'm creating. I'm the creator of the She Event, Andy, if you've ever heard of it. And I have a collaboration of over 500 black businesses that are part of my organization. That's, that's, that's and uh, we're going to be live at the fairgrounds September 10th. Okay. We do it every year. We have from five to 6,000 in attendance. How are you doing, sweetheart? Good. And, um, yeah, we need your support. That's what's up. That's what's up. And you ain't okay. got no cars on you? No, Ooh. because I'm actually riding yeah. my bike to yeah. a meeting. Yeah, that's what. I got so, you. That's good. I don't. But you remember what happened to the Black Wall Street in the past, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, you know, our, our, same enemy, our same you, enemies are here. I understand that. Well, we same got, people that's that destroyed. That's why we got we to gotta do what we doing, you know, and support uh -huh. each other so that we can fight against it. You know what I'm saying? It was in Greenwood, right? And think about all the towns that are named Greenwood, how they are. Yeah. And that's where Black Wall Street was in Greenwood. Yeah. Well, we had many Black Wall Streets, more than just in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Right there, in you know? Circle Center when we were segregated, we had a lot of Black Wall Streets. Absolutely. Right? Yeah. We had them in every city. And we build them back. I am anyway. And we got our enemies here. You know, you know, Jesus is a black man. You believe in the scriptures? The black messiah? Religion is a, listen, it's a whole nother subject. I'm talking salva salvation. Yeah. Religion, organized religion is man-made, you know, so I'm it talking sure something is. greater, sure something that's it deeper. Sure is. I'm talking about us sure being is. kings and queens. Absolutely. I, I, do, I just want to stop and talk yeah. to you because your yeah. church said yeah. you was a god. Because we're in the image of our god, right? Yeah, that's, that's why I'm talking to talk Yeah, that's so, what's up. Appreciate uh, that. I'll see you. I got to get you. I'm going to seek you out over there. Please Please Thanks please for the conversation. Check out the video. Hey, what up with you? Hey, you believe the scriptures? Yeah. I you do? Yeah. You a Bible student? Uh, hey, you know Jesus is a black man, right? Huh? I bet you don't teach that. I bet you don't teach that. How come these preachers don't teach that? Because it's uh, organized religion is a uh, white supremacy. That's why they don't. I'm sorry you feel that way. I really It is. You don't I agree really with that? Sorry you know Christ is not Caucasian. Come on, everybody. He's not. Right. Right. So you said you why do you why are you sorry I don't agree then? If I'm just telling the truth. You see how phony they are? He got caught. Yeah, when I he knows Christ is not white. Y'all know Jesus is not white, right? Y'all know Christ is not white. Christ is a Negro, black man. From the tribe of Judah. Coming back to judge the earth. Coming back to judge the white man for his crimes. Your time is up, white man. Your time is up. Your guns ain't gonna save you. Your guns ain't gonna save y'all. Jesus coming back to judge y'all. Jesus coming back to judge the earth. The white man is in his last days. Your guns can't save you. The hand of the Lord is against the wicked. The Lord coming back in anger. The Lord is coming back in fury. The Lord is coming back to trample the wicked under his feet. He's coming back for you Edomites. He's coming back to destroy you white folks. He's going to destroy you devils. He's going to destroy the children of Esau. You Edomites. He's going to destroy you with his hands. He's going to destroy you with his feet. 
He's going to destroy you with the sword of his mouth. He's going to destroy you in his anger. He's going to destroy you in his wrath. He's going to destroy you with his fury. He's going to destroy you with the scriptures. America's fallen. Babylon is fallen. Babylon is fallen. Edomites, you in your last days. The black Messiah, Jesus Christ, is coming back to judge you. He's got your files. Just look at your history. Look at your crimes. Look at your works. Look what you have done to his people. Look what you have done to the earth. The black Messiah is coming back to judge white people, Edomites, and your guns can't save you. Stock up on your guns if you want to, but they won't help you. Your guns will not save you. There's no bullet that can penetrate the Lord. There's no weapon formed against the Lord that can prosper. There's no weapon formed against his people that can prosper. You at the end of days, white folks. Famine coming. Starvation coming. Famine's coming. Better stock up, bro. It's coming. We're in the fourth quarter, bro. Better stock up. You better be doomsday prepping. Better be doomsday prepping. White people, you going down. And the children of Israel are rising up. The children of Israel are increasing. And you're waxing weaker and weaker. By the hour. Damn devils, your time is up. The black man's going to rule over you. You're going into slavery. You and your children. And your children's children. Thousand generations. Your time is up, white man. You had 400 years. You had a 400 year head start. Now look at you. Now look at you. You're losing your jobs. You're losing your homes. Your savings are dwindled. Now look at you. Your homeless rate is, is, is out, out the roof. Huh? Your last days. Jesus coming. Jesus is coming for you. He's coming to torture you, white folks. He's coming to destroy you, white folks. What you sold, you're going to reap. Horrors are coming to you. Hell is coming to you. Hell is coming for you. You shall be brought down to the size of the pit. You shall be brought down to hell and destruction. Fire and brimstone coming for you. <laughs> Talking about global warming. And you got floods. You got droughts. Food is disappearing. Your farms are closed down. You got about two months left. You got about two months left. If that. Jesus is coming to get you.
He's going to hunt you from every hill. He's going to hunt you from the high places. He's already got me. You can't, you can't hide under the ground in your bunkers. Jesus is coming for you. The black Messiah is coming for you. To destroy you. There's no salvation for Edomites. There is no salvation for you. Salvation is for the 12 tribes, for the Israelites. Salvation is for the slaves, descendants, 12 tribes of Israel. Black people, you are the 12 tribes of Israel. Wake up before it's too late for that door close. Time is running out. Time is short. White man, you can run, but you can't hide. You can run, but you can't hide. The Almighty God sees all, knows all, hears all, and understands all. Judgment coming. Great Depression coming. Sorrows are coming. The thing... Your worst nightmares are coming. Your worst nightmares coming. And you shall not escape. You shall not escape the hand of the Lord. You shall not escape the wrath of the God. You've been wicked in his sight. And your sins and the stench of your wretchedness has ascended up into the heavens. And the Lord has had enough. He's had enough with you Edomites. He's had enough of your wickedness. America will be destroyed. America will be destroyed. The wicked will be destroyed. Edomites will be destroyed. His righteous elect shall inherit the earth. White man, you got to let go of the earth. You coming out of power. You losing your grip. The earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. The world and they that dwell therein. You better render unto God that which is God's. Take your hands off his people, Pharaoh. Take your hands off his elect. You owe reparations. All you white folks are guilty. With your white privilege, that makes you guilty. White privilege makes you guilty. This earth belongs to the black man. This earth belongs to the black man. America belongs to the black man. You a thief and a robber, white man, woman and child. You a thief and a robber. The Lord's coming back to collect. The Lord's coming back to give the earth to his rightful owners. How'd you get America? You stole it. You stole America. How'd you get the black man over here? You stole the black man. You stole the black man and woman. And you gotta pay for that. Blood on your hands, white people. Blood on your hands. Lord's coming back for your heads. 
Hands gotta roll. Hands gotta roll. The Lord's coming back for your blood. White man, you the devil. Your fathers are the devils. Your forefathers. Your first father Esau is the devil. You are the wicked. Black people come out from among these devils. Separate yourself from these devils. They are the children of Satan. And they will corrupt you. The wicked seduce the righteous. The righteous is more excellent than his neighbor. But the way of the wicked seduces them.